Hey guys, thanks for checking out my what's in my bag video. So my bags um, pretty much are really organized and I feel like what's in my bags are kind of the same regardless. I think they've been the same for the last year. Um, I've gotten different small leather goods which have made it a little, more, little bit more organized but overall I kind of feel like my what's in my bags are a little boring which is why I never tend to do them. But today I'm switching out from my totally MM to my Alma PM and um, in my Alma, <clears throat> I can fit almost the exact same things. However, my toiletry 19 has become a catch-all in all of my bags. I literally just take it out and put it into the next one. So ultimately, this is going to be a what's in my bag, but also a what's in my toiletry 19. So let's get started. Here is my Alma, or my totally MM in the Azure. Um, <clears throat> I can do a review on it at some point. Ultimately, I've had it now for two years and it's in really good condition. So let's get started on what's in my bag. So here is the inside. As you can see, I do have a purse organizer. It is the purse bling purses to go organizer. So I ultimately got that when I first got this bag to um, kind of, since it's the light lining, I didn't want anything to happen to the inside of the bag. I knew it was going to get dirty. So I wanted to make sure that was one of the first things that I added to it. So first things first, I have my sunglasses. These are the Saint Laurent. Um, I don't even really know what the style is. I've looked it up a few times, but they're blue. They're great. They um, need to be sized, which I wish that um, I would have tried on a couple other pairs when I bought these, but I do really like the way they look. So I've got those. And while I'm doing it, I will go ahead and just put them right into this this is literally one of my favorite bags um i have noticed that they are coming out with so much more in this denim print and i'm just so torn um i really want a uh um new speedy 25 bandolier so they are coming out with this in the speedy 25 bandolier and i'm so torn because i really want to get it but i feel like it's so similar to this that um i don't know if it's really worth getting it but we'll see and I also today I think I'm going to put on my little bag charm um I just love the way the bag charm looks on here I love the pink versus the blue so and as you can see this bag is totally empty so as I transfer the things out of my um totally I'll just set them right into my bag and I'll kind of show you as I go along how I pack it so so far I just have my sunglasses and I set everything pretty much in a row like a bookshelf that way. Next I have, this is um, my treasures pouch. I have done a video on this. I'll go ahead and link it up in whichever corner it goes, but this is kind of my treasures pouch. So that always goes somewhere in my bag. And next I have my Sarah wallet. I also have done reviews on this one. I'll go ahead and link those as well. Um, such a great wallet. I just, I love this wallet. So that's going to go right in there. And I also have my newest addition, my six key holder. And this um, is in the uh, pink lining, which I like. Um, so... That is gonna go right in there as well. And what else? Uh, lastly, oh, I have a pencil, which I never carry pen pencils, which is odd, but I was running to the grocery store. Here's my grocery list from last night and I needed something just to cross it off. So I threw those in one of the side pockets. And in this purse, I also have in this big, large side compartment, two cards that my boyfriend gave me. Um, I've had these in this purse since he gave them to me. I don't even know why. I've never taken them out. One is a birthday card. <laughs> and I am a card fanatic. I write cards all the time. I used to be a lot better than I am now, but I constantly leave cards kind of all over the house. And I also leave them, I send them even from our own house. I send them to our house for him. Um, so he's not a card person that much. He's getting better, but whenever I do get cards from him, I always get really excited. So this was one, the first time that I left to go to LA 
um, when we were together. So both of those are in there. And lastly, I have my toiletry 19. This is a perfect bag. Just um, to show you, I'm going to set it in here as it is full and it's totally fine. Everything fits in there. Let's see if I can do a close up. Um, and it fits in there really nicely, but like I said, my toiletry 19 is ridiculously full. So I'm going to go ahead and go through this a little bit. Um, I have found, I originally bought the cosmetic pouch and I did do review comparing the cosmetic pouch, um, to what fits in it and that kind of stuff. And I just found like the shape of it just didn't work with the bags that I had and what I wanted to carry in it. So here is my cosmetic pouch full of all sorts of stuff. I have tissues, I have um, the new beauty blender, Blotterazzi, which I actually comes in these little like things and I actually really like it. I don't, I use it more I think for the mirror, but it's great just to kind of blot any oily spots. So I do really like those. I have a Lamy pen. These are, I, if you guys have watched any of my other videos, I have a lot of these and I like those. I have a phone charger. I also have, which I guess I clearly don't need anymore since I have the blotter. Let's see, I have a Sephora mirror. So I'll set that aside. I have a two Chanel's. I have Chanel 54 Boy, which I think I have done a review on this. This is just such a perfect color. I just love it. I just feel like it's a good all day, every day kind of color. And then I have the Rouge Coca Bomb, which will also go back in there. I have the plug to my charger, which I don't really need in here. So I'll set that aside. Uh, maybe I will keep it. Who knows? Um, and then I just have a whole bunch of messy stuff. So let's see. Oh, I have an earring that I left somewhere and it's taken me like probably six months to get back. It had broken and fallen off. Um, I have a whole bunch of, let's see if I can pull them all out, feminine products. Um, so we don't need to have that many in there. Oh, and here's actually some more of those. We don't need all of those. I have two blister band-aids, two regular band-aids. I always try to keep those. Um, I have a sugar, which is one of my favorites, but I do feel like if I have the Chanel, I don't really need to have this in there, but I do always tend to have one with me. Uh, I have another blister band-aid. I have feminine wipes for that time of the month that I'll put on that side. Um, I have a, which one is this one from? Another Saks Louis Vuitton card, which is from the Saks in, um, on Wilshire in Beverly Hills. So I'll add that to all of my other business cards. Couple more um, band-aids. I have another pen. I have some rubber bands and a safety pin, more hair ties. Um, I have this, I think it's a, oh, it's the, my eyeglass, um, wipey thing, which is odd because I think I actually have uh, one in my eyeglass case too, but then I have an extra pair of contacts. I have a sponge, which is odd because I don't think there's anything that I would need my sponge for when I'm out and about. Um, Christmas Eve mass, my sister uh, opened up her purse and had all these really cute little individually packed Tic Tacs, um, strawberry, mango, and melon. So I stole them from inside her purse while we were sitting at Nats. Um, I also have some more safety pins, which if anyone knows, I end up with 800 of these in my pocket every day when I'm working. So I always end up with them in places, but they're also great. I actually think if you're putting on mascara, sometimes I'll use them to like, I know it's so awful, but like kind of spread out my lashes. I feel like if anyone ever needs a safety pin, they always ask me because I always have them. So have those. And the last thing is this zip tie. I bought 
um, for Christmas this year, I bought these like safety things for everyone. If you haven't seen, I think that I had them. They're called Rescue Me and they're in my um, Christmas gift guide. So I'll link that video as well. But this goes to that. So anyways, it's a little dusty on there. Whew. That is my empty toiletry 19. I'll go ahead and restuff it and put it back in my bag and I'll be good to go. So hopefully you guys have a good day and I look forward to seeing you guys soon. If you have any questions or comments, definitely link them below. Um, I am sort of kind of starting to look at newer vlog cameras or video cameras. Um, lately I've been using a Sony camera, which is totally fine. But when I go out to California, it's actually my boyfriend's camera. So I think I will end up leaving here. So if you guys have any suggestions, link it below or um, comment below. I'd love to hear kind of what you guys use for your YouTube channels. And yeah, I'm heading to Saks today. Um, and I think I'm going to end up ordering the Pachette Matisse, which I can't remember if I commented um, in one of my luxury item tags or whatever that I thought that it was kind of all hype. But now I'm seeing how functional it is and I'm seeing it compared with things and it's so cute and I'm so torn if I want to get the regular monogram or the reverse. So we'll see what I end up with. Um, I think I have to order it from my sales associate in California. So anyways, have a good day. Hope you guys all are doing well. Thanks.